Hello guys, today I'm gonna show you the Royal Air Force Museum in London. It includes five buildings and hangars showing the history of aviation and the Royal Air Force. Established in 15 November in 1972, about 47 years ago. The museum site at Collindale was once part of the Rough Hendon Station and prior to that, one of the first civilian airfields acquired by Claude Graham White in 1911. The museum was officially open, opened at the Collindale London site on 15 November 1972 by Queen Elizabeth II. The hangars house 36 aircraft at opening. Over the years, the collection increased and aircraft not on display at Hindon were stored or displayed at smaller local RAF station museums. This is uh, Hangar 1, RAF Stories, the first 100 years. 1918-2018 of the rough. This is about first 100 years. From its creation in 1918 as the world's first independent air force. It explores the different roles of the people of the rough alongside the changes in technology. This is Hunger 2, also known as the Graham White Factory, shows the earliest days of flight on the site of the London Aerodrome. Through to the formation of the independent Royal Air Force in 1918. The First World War was the introduction of air power.
These hangars focus on the aircrafts of the Second World War and the Cold War. It includes original Battle of Britain fighter aircraft. Hangar 5 The Bomber Hall shows bombers which were types used during the Battle of Britain. Also there is Hangar 6. It shows the rough from 1980 to the 21 century. Also, the museum contains a restaurant uh, built within the 1930s and next to it uh, there is a children's play area with mini RAF aircraft, vehicles and a lot of stuff. Also, uh, the museum's archives containing thousands of paper, documents, books and photographs are situated on the top floor of hangars.
subscribe to my channel and big thumbs up thank you